Hey guys, Vita here. So today's video is going to be a little different. Today's video, I am going to tell you about some things happening in my personal life that may affect my business life in the next month or two. So let's get started. Okay. Every now and then, my videos I may mention that I have medical issues, I have lupus, I had since I was 16, and I'm on dialysis because my lupus affects my kidneys and all that kind of good, good stuff. Yeah. So, I mentioned that sometimes in, the, in my videos now and then, not always, that's not focused on this channel, and I keep my personal life and business life separate, but recently, my business life and my personal life are going to collide. Okay, so, that one dialysis, um, dialysis is a good thing beyond when you, when you have kidney failure, because it helps your kidneys kind of function somewhat on a normal basis, and keeps you alive and healthy in some way. But, it can be draining and annoying and aggravating at some time. So, and I have been on dialysis for four years now. Long time, too long. So, that right now is too too long. I off, the only way for me to get off dialysis completely and to live somewhere in the normal life again without dealing with dialysis going three days a week is I need a kidney transplant. So, where someone either gives me a volunteers to give me their kidney out of their own body. Through surgery, or someone, has, or someone has died, and and then they're a match, and we can match together, and we kidneys happens, and all stuff like that. So I have been on the MIU transplant list for four years, yeah, about four, three, four, three years now, and um, it's been a struggle. It hasn't been. I haven't had any matches until now. Yeah. So that I've been on dialysis for four years and haven't had any good matches. Well, until lately, my okay. Before I tell you who is my mask, before I even tell you about that, before the person, before I announce who they are, um, I've had people, friends, and family and friends come forward and say, "Yes, I'll donate. Yeah, I will do that." And I appreciate it. everybody has done that, and it's wonderful. But as a match or that didn't go through, or somehow they worked out, it's okay. It's donating your, to organ to someone is a big deal. It's a great thing to do. But it's also a very big deal and stressful and can be life changing. So everybody cannot do it. Does not work. It's, everybody can't do it. This so it's not a world. It's not how it is. But when you find a good match and do it, go for it. Do it. But see, the person who donated me has to want to do it. So I have struggled with finding a donor because it's been hard to people to do it and no one has matched and I have found anything. So I've been down for, for so, so long. And I've been looking at doing things like that. But my husband has always been constant in wanting to donate. And I've always been, if you like doing it, I'm like, no, you cannot do it. I don't want to do it in the first place because he, because I don't want to happen to him. My concern is my husband. I care about him. So, but he is eager and wanting to do it because he knows how long I've been down. It's been a long time. He sees me, how I get frustrated with it sometimes and don't want to do it and give up and say, he, he trusts me to keep going. So he has decided to get tested to be a donor. He got tested to be a donor about last week. It was a lot of testing. It got a lot of blood work and everything. And then I think some more blood work as well with him and all So we took a lot of blood work in one day for us to get in where we would match matches. Now they're looking for if his blood will not attack my blood and all that kind of stuff. And it's very medical complicated, but it's meant with actually not like, our bodies have to not, like, hate each other so they can get along. So if he gives me his kidney, it will work in me, and I want my body will reject it. That's the main point. So we'll be able to see if that will happen or not. So, after the we waited for day of testing, and the results come back, and the results have been in. The results from all the work we did is that my husband is a match, and I'm getting a new kidney. Woohoo! It's exciting. So, I'm very excited it's happening. It's finally happening. It took a long time. Um, I kind of didn't think it would happen because, like, I thought it was being down so long. It's like, 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 really. But it's actually happening. So, I'm happy I walked out and, like, live normal life, do things because I got things to do. I got things to catch up on. And I have more time, more energy to do more stuff. So, I'm looking forward to it. My husband, his blood work came out good. He's healthy. Nothing wrong with him. He's, he's more better shaped than I am. So I'm very happy it's going. I feel a little more relieved that he's okay. That he'll be okay. We still do some more things like to meet with the surgeon and other doctors and do more testing. But overall, the general stuff came out. The important stuff they're looking at came out 
perfect and everything is good and he is out the and we are good and we're match. So we're going to surgery. We're not sure when surgery is what happened, but sometime early summer, midsummer. So May, June, July, that area. So, but we'll have you out that part that will affect my business and video making of all this surgery I'm having and kidneys I'm getting. See, after my surgery, I'm going to be a bed rest for an entire month. I mean, I can't go outside because my body would be sick to germs and things like that. So I have to indoors in a clean area and I'm staying hot. I be home in bed, rest in bed, ready for an entire month. So that kind of work that makes me have to change my routine on videos and artwork I could do. I could talk to my doctor about my artwork and um, I paint and it's going gonna, it's gonna to be a problem with me painting. You know, paint has chemicals in it and that's not good. <laughs> Because I just got, I just got a kidney. I need to not have any chemicals breathing in anything toxic. So I need to talk to my doctor about that. But I think it'll be okay. My pain is mostly not toxic. I'm gonna look at the jar to see what's not in them or what's in, you know. So but look at all that stuff. But when it comes to video making, like my usual videos, that may change. I'm going to stick with my same schedule of Mondays and Fridays. But my area of filming will be different I need to clear that I'll be better in I have to stay in bed. So I will be doing videos from my bed. I mean my bed looks pretty so I have a pretty background and everything. But I'll be doing videos from bed and I'll be not be doing as much videos like I won't do no going out because I'm not going out. I can't go out for a month. But uh it'll be more videos from bed. I'll be probably doing talking videos more and maybe some art videos and screen uh, some Screen, uh, screen video, video what I do from the computer, things like that. It'd be a little more simpler because I'll be kind of swaying to one area and I can't do much for a entire month. But it won't be so bad. It will work out. I mean, we'll make it work. So I'm working and changing that now. Um, I'm not sure what's going to be, but I, once I find out, I'll let everybody know. So when you start seeing the bed videos coming, <laughs> they'll be coming soon. But yeah. So that's the change that's happening. I'll be having surgery. I'm getting a kidney. I have, have no more dialysis. I'll be great. I'm very happy about it. I'm very thankful that my husband is willing to do this and he's excited about his focus on it and he wants to give me a dialysis because he loves me and he wants to be healthy and we're all on the same page. So we're happy about that. My family is very happy about it, excited about it. Uh, my friends and my doctors are very happy. So we're all great. This took a long time to do. I'm I'm still like no about it. I haven't really hit me yet. That some like, used to be on dialysis. I'm not really like really sunken yet. But I think it will sunk in more and more when time goes by. But it hasn't really like sunken yet. But it's happening. It's real. So we're all excited. I'm excited. Those are the changes coming soon to me and the videos for you. So thank you for watching and I hope you enjoy the video and learn what's going on with me and will stay with me during this time a little change is going on it's doing well um, I'm still doing my bad collection they're working well you can follow me on Instagram to see progress of those on my website too and if you're not subscribed to, video, to this video to this channel please do subscribe um, and I will see you next time bye